Hi, I'm Martha Peterson. Welcome to Essential Somatics. The word somatic means what it feels like to be in your body. When you're somatically aware, you know what your body is doing and how to control your movement. Over the course of our lives, our muscles can become so tight due to stressful experiences such as accidents, injuries, surgeries, or ongoing stresses that no matter what you do, be it massaging, stretching, or even drugging the muscles, the muscles won't stay relaxed. It's important to understand that the brain controls the muscles. So just as the brain teaches us how to ride a bicycle, swing a golf club, or draw a picture, so can it teach us how to hold ourselves tightly in response to stress. It's important to point out that we all respond to stress with specific reflexive patterns of contraction. So even if one part of your body, your shoulders or your hip for instance, is painful, there's always a full body pattern of contraction occurring that makes it difficult to relax that part of the body. Private one-on-one -on -one clinical somatic sessions are the most rapid way to begin to eliminate your particular pattern of habituated muscular pain and to get the brain back in control of the muscular system. Group classes and workshops are also important to continue improving muscle function, body awareness, and movement once you have learned to reverse your pain. When addressing neck and shoulder pain, we don't just focus on those two areas of the body. If the neck is stiff, it also means that the center of the body is stiff. Many people with neck pain have postures that look like this. We call this the red light reflex. If you're afraid or you're worried, you tighten the muscles of the front of the body and slump forward. The neck is pulled forward as the front of the body contracts. And this can contribute to disc problems, jaw tightness, and a host of other painful conditions. This can also happen due to long hours at the computer or in a car, or when dealing with emotional stress. We call it the red light reflex because we stop and tighten. Another reflex that contributes to neck and shoulder pain is the green light reflex. When you need to get something done quickly or the phone rings or someone calls your name, you instantly contract your back muscles. You're always ready for action. When you sit at the desk reading hundreds of emails and unknowingly arching your lower back, you create not only tight lower back muscles, but tight neck and shoulder muscles as well. We call it the green light reflex because we feel the need to go, go, go. Always being ready for action can make us pretty tense in our bodies. Legs and hip joints can lose their flexibility and become tight and painful for several reasons. If you sit all day at your job, your hip flexors, the muscles at the front of the hip joint, learn to stay tight. If you have a sudden accident, you slip down the stairs or you fall, your brain instantly contracts the muscles on one side of the body in order to avoid further pain or injury. And this is called the trauma reflex. If you have an injury on one side of the body, the body compensates to nurse that injury until it's fully healed. And this compensation can develop into a limp or the need to hold the body differently during the healing period. The muscles often continue to contract even after the injury is healed, leaving you a little tilted and off balance. And when this happens, the large muscles in the center of the body that attach into the pelvis, the back, the waist, and the abdominals, compensate unequally in order to keep you moving. Even mothers holding babies on their hip can develop an habituated trauma reflex pattern due to the need to make a perch for their child. So if you're unaware of what you're doing, you might begin to walk as if you were a car with one flat tire. Your gait becomes unbalanced, and the unequal weight into one side of your body will create hip, knee, foot, and joint pain. During a private movement session, you lie on a low table and are guided hands-on through gentle, easy movements designed to reverse your specific patterns of chronic muscle tension. With hands-on help and measured resistance from the practitioner, you will begin to retrain your brain to release painful muscles and regain freedom of movement. This improves the brain's awareness and begins the process of becoming more able to self-monitor, self-correct, and self-adjust your posture, movement, and responses to stress. Each session focuses on your particular needs, history of muscular pain, and movement habits. At the end of each session, you will learn specific somatic exercises to practice on your own at home. An easy daily five to 10 minute somatics routine reinforces the improvement you get in each private session. Your home practice is the linchpin to long-term pain relief and the ability to reverse your own pain whenever you wish. Whether you have 5 minutes or 45 minutes, even a few minutes of somatic movements a day can make all the difference in your muscles. Be well and thanks for joining me.